tax increase was solely to millionaires, and uh, the C and the White House says that the Nobel laureates believe that it will not increase inflation. What evidence do you have that it will? Well, there are a couple of things, and let's start with this is not really just two trillion dollars. I think it's much closer to four trillion dollars because what the Democrats have added in after their election losses has been tax breaks. For millionaires, this is not just me saying it. The experts are saying, with what is in this bill, and Americans, the more they find out about it, the less they like it. Specifically, all the new IRS agents who are going to be hired an army of IRS agents to do more audits. The experts are telling us that 30% of middle-class Americans will end up paying higher taxes. And what Nancy Pelosi has shoved in the special tax breaks for millionaires in California, New York, New Jersey. That is actually going to give a tax break to two thirds of the millionaires in America. The reason I think prices are going to go way up is because of some of the things that they have put into the bill on energy and on climate, which are going to raise energy costs considerably in the year ahead at a time when the American people are already paying sky high prices to heat their homes, to drive their cars, to buy groceries, and inflation, as we know, hurts the most vulnerable. Who gets hurt with inflation? Yes. It's the poor people, the people living on a fixed income. It's the elderly. It's all of these folks struggling to get by. I would have never believed that Joe Biden, in just ten months in the presidency, could bring us to a thirty-year high of inflation.